is should I use a spray or a wipe on formula? Well, we definitely have some knowledge on this because we actually started our initial G Clear product with a spray formula several years ago. Uh, and after a few years in the market, we learned that the wipe on formula really uh, was the way to go. So let's break down the kind of the three main reasons as to why and some things to consider if you're comparing different products on the market, uh, spray versus wipe on. Now the first thing is the ease of application. Uh, the spray tends to develop drips, uh, especially if the can or the aerosol can is not stored just right, or if you're working in a little bit of ambient sunlight or even worse in direct sunlight. Uh, it's difficult to get a perfect kind of self level across the surface without getting drips with the spray formula. So that's one thing to consider. Whereas with the wipe on formula, even if you've got some sunlight, you can generally get a really smooth application once you've done it a few times. Uh, you kind of get the hang of, of how to do it just right. Now the other thing to factor is that when you're spraying uh, an OEM uh, formula for hard code, generally speaking it's a pretty potent chemical formula. So uh, by spraying it you're putting that out into the air and you're cre increasing the odds of your inhalation. Of course we always recommend regardless of wipe on or spray that you use a mask or, or even a, uh, a respirator um, when, you're, when you're applying the coating. But by, by wiping it on versus spraying it, you're reducing greatly the amount of uh, uh, airborne chemicals that are, that are in the air that you could potentially, or those in the shop or in your area could potentially be breathing in. So that's another thing to factor in. And the third reason is just simply cost and ROI, right? The, the return on investment for the product that you purchased. There's certainly an inherent cost with uh, producing something in an aerosol bottle which then gets passed on to the customer. So if you're comparing say an 8 ounce bottle of one product that's spray on versus an 8 ounce bottle of another product like the G Clear that is wipe on, uh, you really can't compare them apples to apples. The, the spray on bottle is going to be primarily made up or in great percentage made up of propellants or an additives which help it to essentially operate in an aerosol format. So that's something to factor in too. Uh, certainly if you're comparing pricing, a wipe on formula you're going to get a lot more out of than you would with a spray on formula. The other disadvantage of spray on formulas is that they are finicky when it comes to weather. If they get a lot of heat then that can definitely affect the pressure within the, the bottle, so it's definitely something to factor in when you're considering that as well. Now, let's say you're in a professional body shop setting or you're a detailer, certainly you can use the G Clear formula in a professional spray gun. We have customers that do it, that cut it with a, you know, with, with one of their propellants and then we'll, we'll operate it with a professional piece of equipment onto the vehicle itself and that can work great. Uh, but for the average guy out there or technician out there, uh, you're gonna definitely want to use a wipe-on formula in most cases versus a spray.